hello guys so today is uh, we are going to see some interesting topics i have a two div uh, one is a div id uh, div1 and div2 so what i have i i, I want uh, today is i just want to move this uh, div2 uh, here uh, into the div2 how to move this uh, html uh, element uh, to uh, this uh, that is my uh, uh, question and the solution that i am going to give you uh, so uh, there is a two way to bind a uh, uh, add this element to here one is uh, uh, if you want to add this div in the top section so uh, like here uh, something like here or after all the stuffs uh, happened in the div so this is my two uh, two stuffs that I I need to build one is uh, to add this div to here it means like uh, uh, like a cut and paste here uh, like this it has to be otherwise it has to be uh, append in the last of the um, uh, element uh, so how to do this one is the today's task okay I just remove this stuff here okay so I go into write and small script on the page load okay okay slash div one so initially i want to bind this div uh, be here it means this control i want to move in the front of uh, the div element so how to do that it's very simple by using the small uh, stuff so prepend to prepend to which i uh, element i going the destination element destination is uh, test do okay the source element which i want to prepend uh, this is a uh, own controller that uh, we done now okay we just go on the run in the page and we'll see how this is worked mm, yeah it's good uh, now it's uh, it's prepared uh, over here we'll see how this is uh, things I'm going to uh, inspect uh, the element or uh, I just uh, go to show and uh, show the page source okay where it is where it is yes here it is okay page source is uh, different uh, so on the runtime we have to see inspect the element then only we can see the steps we'll see how this things has happened container yeah this is my uh, div o2 uh yeah here if you see uh this is my destination div2 my uh, div1 is uh, appended in uh, before whatever the data that uh, presented in the destination okay it's good let me go and change small stuffs smaller uh, extension method uh, on sec uh, here I going to call append to so this will append uh, in the last okay simply I'll just uh, refresh my page you can see that okay uh, now my page is ready I'm going to expand the div this is inside uh, this is a destination uh, now you got it uh, we got the solution that uh, the after all the data or whatever the element defined inside uh, the destination after that my source uh, element is binded so this is the uh, way in a runtime uh, to move uh, one HTML element to another or uh, we can move front and back whatever we need wherever we need it so this is one useful stuff that provided by jquery so thanks for watching the video guys